flag has been very important in my country um, because one, it has created a space for more civil society involvement in forest governance. Um, it has helped um, reinforce um, legal reform. Uh, it has helped um, community voices to be heard more. So I'll, I'll see that as three most important achievements. And that's, that's very serious achievement because before these things were not happening like that. Some of the concrete results is that civil society now, through the VPA, has started monitoring um, forest sector governance. So for example, civil society has organized a program sponsored by the European Union to go about their monitoring program. And that's bringing civil society together very more and more. There's cohesiveness among civil society organizations and also there's capacity um, strengthening um, of civil society and communities. There is more awareness, there is more information. Civil society has created a platform and through that platform, it engaged it with it, civil society in Liberia engaged with the um, forest sector and with the VPA particularly. So we had ha we have had representatives on the different um, groups or committees. Uh, we monitoring how com companies are complying with the law, how they are able to pay community benefits whether they are exporting legal logs based on what they're supposed to do according to what the law says and then report, document, report to the government, report back to civil society groups and report to the GIC once the GIC is set up. Although the GIC hasn't been set up but we still will share the report with um, other stakeholders and the EU. Uh, our first report will be coming up um, at the close of this year. And we hope that recommendations from the report can be taken seriously. Timor helped to finance the war, but then the UN put sanction on Timor because of that. And before they lifted that sanction, the government was required to put some reform in place that gives civil society again the opportunity during that reform to call on the government to recognize us more so and to recognize communities who um, are protecting the forest who live in the forest who bear the worst of what, what operations companies carry on in the forest so we use that as an opportunity and civil society had more role to play uh, but then the VP has reinforced that because the law, law, law enforcement was still broken, it was still weak, even after the reform. Um, civil society and the government relationship was screened. The government could not listen easily to what we said. They took us more as enemies and rather as people who were concerned about what um, um, uh, they were doing right or wrong. So. The VPN now has brought us together to be able to have discussion and agree on what's affecting forest governance and law enforcement and what's more work workable and how we can go about it.